Greetings buddies, I welcome everybody in the Usatility channel. Are you an active player of Dawn of Zombies and want to enjoy this game on a big screen? In this video, you will find out about playing Dawn of Zombies on PC. You may already know, this is an Android OS game, and we are going to learn how to run it on the computer system. Keep watching the video so that you'll not skip even a single part. Let's just start. To install this game on the computer, I have given a website link for you in the description of the video. It is the URL, I display it right here in case you want to see it slightly more prominent. Right here is the website link of this game in Bluestacks. Bluestacks is the software we will use to download and install the game as well as play it on the computer system. Bluestacks is an amazing program to download and install virtually any mobile game on a big screen. Click the option, Download Dawn of Zombies for PC, so that you can download this game, the download is completed right here in the file. Only touch on this file now. In Windows 10, it will have asked us for permission, we enter yes and then accept. To view the game installer, it's advised to minimize the browser tab like that. Now I'm going to set up the directory for the installation of the game. When we visit, customize the installation, we can choose the directory. We just leave it as it is, we simply click back, and we select the install now option. This file is tiny and will be saved within little time. Determined by your internet connection, it'll be faster or slower. It'll then set up the emulator on the computer. As you have seen, the file is installed. Do not forget that the system will require some time to make configurations for Bluestacks and also to launch it, but the next time, it'll start instantly. Keep the eyes stick to the screen since we will describe an essential step now. We should sign in to Google Play, we will head over to, sign in. Sign in, once again, and it'll ask us the details to sign in to Google Play. It is essential to log in if we want to install this game. Like we have explained, we will enter the email as well as the password to log in to the Google account. We've logged into it, and we are welcomed. To carry on game installation, we accept the terms by clicking, I agree. It tells us that if we like to make a backup of our device in the cloud, we select no, you do what you would like. We just accept it, and it will quickly head over to Google Play. If you want to get free from the emulator here's an arrow, press on it. Note that the two icons are exhibited here, which are Bluestacks and then Bluestacks Multi Instance. Bluestacks icon is for starting the Bluestacks app. Right after performing all of the essential parts, we have ultimately reached the installation phase. For this reason, we start Google Play in Bluestacks. Dawn of Zombies is now being downloaded, hold back. Speedier net connection is advised to complete the game download quickly. To keep the length of the video short, I'm going to skip this part and will be back later. Therefore, it has been already done installing, and as you can view, it has now made an additional icon on your computer's desktop, Dawn of Zombies, which will let us access the game without needing to go to the Bluestacks. Similar to all other applications that you open on your computer, this Dawn of Zombies game will begin right after clicking this icon two times. You can also open the game with the help of Bluestacks. Look, we will start Dawn of Zombies by hitting this icon. You can even customize the settings of the keyboard from right here. Because we aren't eager to change keyboard options and so we will leave them as it is. Would you like to have fun with the game, even on a big screen? If yes, there are two ways. You can simply increase the emulator, and the screen will broaden. It wouldn't be a 100% full screen. By pressing F11, you will get a 100% full screen for this game. Once you start playing the game in full screen setting, you'll be able to better concentrate on the game. In case you have a powerful PC, then it will better assist gaming within an emulator. You may also even alter the language of the game. To modify the language, select this cogwheel, and then hit on preferences. There are various languages readily available in this game. And that is translated. Anyhow, this is the game installed. Quite simple if you liked this video, just give a thumb up, like it, subscribe if you like the Usatility channel as well as any feedback you have left in the comment box, and we will reply. Thank you very much for paying attention to the video, and we'll see you in a new video. Bye.